Hello Sagittarius and welcome to your coffee cup reading for the week of October 18th and this is a very general reading. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. There's an overall energy here that I'm seeing like um, slow it down. Whether it's your temper, whether it is your excitement, whether it is sadness, happiness... Um, something you need to slow down a little just, or, you know, you hear something or you want to make a decision really quick or, you know, you hear a rumor. Not everything is as it seems is what I'm feeling here. Now, productive, productive energy is showing up. So there could be something you are mauling over, but, you know, you may have all these ideas or, you know what I mean, but you need to build upon something. This is a time to just go ahead and do it. But again, slowly does it. All right? Do not make any promises you can't keep this week. Do not believe everything you hear. Um, others may, you know, promise you something. I always like to say, oh, yeah, you know, someone's excited. They say, oh, right, let's go out. Let's have fun. And you set a date. And then that day, the person either doesn't feel like it or didn't realize they had something else. So don't hold anyone to their word, but you be a person of your word too. So if you do promise to do something, it would be important to do so. Otherwise, don't promise something you can't keep. For some of you, this is open lines of communication with someone. Um, it's like a restart. It's like, you know, um, maybe you had a fallout and now it's like, okay, introduce yourselves. Let's start all over the clean, this clean slate. For others of you, this could be dating as well. So I do see that. Now... You could be dealing with someone young. This could be a child around, too. Hmm. That's all I've seen there. Expect the unexpected. Okay? I do feel there can be, you know, a sudden turn of events. For some of you, things may, if it's been going too fast and rapidly, it turns around, the energy turns, it's a shift of energy, and now things slow down. For others, it's the opposite. So I do see that energy. Um, there is some kind of fortunate luck here. I do like that. But again, slow down. Just because, just say, you know, you find, yeah, you could find $200 in the street or something. Let's say, hey, nice, huh? Don't go spend it in one um, second, you know? No nanoseconds here. So slow down with anything is what I'm feeling here. Slow and steady does it. All right? Because then you're going to have some, either buyers or more, some kind of regrets. And then you're going to be beating yourself up somehow, okay? So I do see that. Slowing down is important. I also see an Aquarius energy. You're stronger than you know this week, all right? This is going to be a week that your buttons could be pushed, so your patience, your anger, your um, tolerance could be tested, okay? But you could be the taming force here. So restraining yourself somehow, you know, pick and choose your battles is the best I could say. Because if you do, it's brief, things will pass, and then it'll be like, okay, thank God I didn't. You know what I mean? Um, so let's not make mountain out of molehills. Whoever wants to, you know, it's like you, you have control over your reactions, um, I see opportunities will present themselves here too. You may get an offer, news, like, hey, let's get together, let's celebrate, let's, you know, have some fun time. I do see that energy too. Uh, for some of you, I want to say temptation or something may be tested. If you got rid of some people or something that were bad influences or just were not working for you or were manipulative or whatever it was or retracted you into your bad habits, this is a time not to test or challenge those waters. Um, stay strong and you'll get through it. It's just, a, it's like there's a sense of temptation here. Okay, so I do feel that energy. So a lot of you I see will walk away from any temptations, fears, or whatever that's coming up. For others, it could be a little bit of a challenge. Um, so I am seeing that. And um, take some time for yourself. Enjoy yourself. Don't involve yourself, you know, with people. Um, this is also guilty by association, I want to say. Be careful who you hang out with this week for some of you, okay? It could be guilty by association, so to speak. So look beyond immediate appearances this week. Not, is, not everything is as it seems. People can have um, ulterior motives, whatever it is. I'm just trying to explain it to you. Discernment is going to be very important because I see here anger. 
um, what, you know, um, there is celebrations. I do see needing to just kind of relax. Okay. Breaking free of any kind of bad habit or people or situations where you feel trapped. It's, you have a choice. Freedom is there for you. Okay. It's what I'm feeling too. I do see for some of you changing your mind, leaving something or walking up literally away from someone or something. And that is probably right this week. Don't assume anything. Don't be involved in rumors. Um, I do see people talking. They could be judging you somehow or they could be gossiping about you. Um, give something another couple weeks for that energy to dissipate from what I'm seeing. This is also something that could be um, others around you in situations are not as they seem. So just say you hear rumors and someone said someone said something and then you confront that person it could be all tangled up in a web and you could accuse the wrong person you know what I mean so there is that energy I do see rebirth here this could be a significant get together family is showing up to or people in your inner circle I see happiness there for you too but where you're getting it to is like needing to rejuvenate Get some rest. It's fun times ahead. Um, I do see victory, success. Um, expect the unexpected. Very nice energy. Um, this is a very creative energy for Sagittarius too. Your imagination could, um, I mean, this is immersing yourself in very creative expression, artistic pursuits. Um, your imagination could strike some kind of creative project. So the best way to put your frustrations in is in some creativity. Okay, so I am seeing that. Now, you know what? You have power and control. You are a master of your own destiny and a captain of your own soul, okay? Um, temptation this week or anything that's bad for you, you know who you really are. You know what you want. Do not become anyone else's illusion. It's clearing the path, and that's going to bring you win situation, success. And for some of you, this is travel movement coming up, too. So I do like that energy as well. Got quite an interesting week, Sagittarius, kind of all over the place. Numbers that could be important this week for you is 10, 8, and 25, okay? All right, Sagittarius, that is your reading for the week of October 18th. I hope you have a wonderful week, and I'll catch you back next week for your next Coffee Cup reading. Bye for now.